In this video, we're going to look at how to fill in the blank for either a missing factor or a missing product in multiplication problems. The top problem, we have 4 times 6 equals blank. The blank is in the product, which means we're looking for the product of the problem or the answer of the multiplication problem. Now what I know is that this multiplication problem means 4 groups of 6 equals blank. So all I have to do is draw 4 groups, make sure I put 6 in each group, and then see how many I have total. And when I do that, I could find out that 4 times 6 is equal to a total of 24. Next, I have 2 times blank equals 12. That means I have two groups with a certain amount in each group. I don't know how many. All I know is that it will be the same number in both groups to equal 12. The easiest way to do this is add 1 to each group at a time until you get to 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And I could see that each group has 6. And the last one, we don't know how many groups we have. We're missing a, the first factor, but we do know there are 4 in each group and that we end up with a total of 16. So what I'll do is I'll draw groups of 4 here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I stop at 16 and I could see that I had a total of 4 groups. This is how you fill in the missing blank while looking for either the factor or the product of a multiplication problem. It always helps to draw out that problem.